Well, can yeah. you start giving me the money you gave him? <laughs> what incentive do I have to do that? Oh, hang on. I gotta go watch Connie. He's crying. Hang on. He's crying. He's crying. Hang on. He's crying? Jesus. Christ. Yeah, he was breaking the laptop a while ago. Listen, like, Bedtime Clown or uh, whatever the fuck your name is. I don't know. Tom. I'll just call you Tom. Okay. Uh, if you just want to get out of this, uh, first of all, you made a uh, pretty good first step. Already, he's pissed at you. Just don't go on his chat anymore. That's it. No, what? Uh, that's all. That's all you gotta do from here on out. Just don't go on the chat Or if you do, just do it under a sock account like all the rest of us do. No, I, I don't. I don't. I don't. Numerous fucking times, and he says, 
you're doxing me. Stop doxing me. You're trying to dox me. You're trying to come to my house. Listen, all I've ever wanted for him is for him just to get a job. That's it. That's the end of the... I don't want him to hurt himself. I don't want anything bad to happen to his mom. I'm not calling some uh, some progress or SSI, whatever. Fuck, I don't care about that. But the thing is, his life is only going to change when he decides to do it. And that change comes in the form of getting a fucking job. Yeah, no, I don't, I don't, Tonic, I don't disagree with you at all. In fact, I've, I've said that on one of his live streams, and he accused me of being poly or whatever the fuck. I, I do disagree with both of you. I think he's going to get his mental health straight before he gets a job. And then fill he, out the disability forms that he won't fill out. But how's he going to do Hold on, hold on, hold on. Look, no, no, let me jump in here. Because Manda, even Manda uh, um, um, from the settlement, Manda would go out of her way to make sure that he could get all that stuff filled out. And once again, it was thrown back in her face. Fuck you, you're trying to dox me, this, that, the other. So it wasn't like said that people haven't tried. People have been trying for the longest fucking time. Mm-hmm. All of us, all of us have gotten burned. So let me let me ask you a question. Let me ask you guys a question. I know Brett says that he's got like what five plus years experience with him and the whole Facebook thing and all of that. How long has this been going on? The Turtle Boy article, which I'm surprised, have you read the Turtle Boy article now or are you still yet to read? Um, I'm not sure. Brett posted a, an article the other day. It like it was it's, it, it's that one. Listen, I hate Turtle Boy and so does Brett like really bad. Like I would honestly rather nail my dick to a fucking desk than ever have to talk to that guy. Right. However, that article is all facts. All of it. There is no fucking thing taken out of context, misconception. He has been doing this forever. Right? When it was on Facebook, it was people that'd be like, oh, I'm so sorry for your situation. I don't really have the money right now. Or I don't need. Well, then fuck you. And then starts proceeding to dox him. Um, you know, you're a godless creature. And you always lean real hard on the religion back in the day. For some fucking odd reason. Um, but this this has always been his thing. This, If you read the article, it is a carbon copy of what he's doing today. It is just a different platform. That's just the truth. I'm, sure, I, I'm spitting pure, unfiltered fucking truth here. No, I believe it. I, I, I believe you. I mean, I, I've, I've been seeing it, seeing it, seeing it, seeing it. And it's the same thing over and over and over again. Um, um can I just say uh, he is now taking out of court? Oh, God, here we go. Oh, he's going to take us to court? Okay. He's going to need to have more surgeries to do that. <laughs> he said he's going to have someone give him to him. Well, he's going to have to have some money to. He said he's going to use that $30 you gave him. To sue me. <laughs> See, yeah. a pension plan, I, I don't know, you're working. Like, I, I'm working stiff ways. It, it never got to you. It never really kind of, like, drilled in your brain when you're sitting there for hours doing your job. You're like, man, kid's just still sitting there begging for $120, $180, $70. Can I get 30 bucks? That's why I told him. That's why I told him yesterday. I'm glad you're fucking doing this because now we can get the fuck out. You know, fuck you. Can I get 30 bucks? Maybe. I'll put my cash out in private chat. Maybe. I don't know. We fresh out, Bobo. I'll, I'll see. I might do it. What? The wells run dry? Uh, only, 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 if you, uh, only if you make sure to go live and fucking run into his face that I gave you 30 bucks and show them the scene. Sorry. You can't give me no more money? What? He just wants to still be a child. And and that's really sad. Is that he will literally turn away disability applications. Or just job applications. To live at home. Be taken care of by mommy. Have her cut the crust off your pb and chain When you sit there and play your little grand thing about how people are exchanging money behind your back and you need $180 for weed that you didn't earn. Stop, I'm live, I'm talking.
talking to bedtime clown. Stop. Beat him, Ace. Beat him, Ace. Beat him, Ace.
but I mean, if, but if you want to give me the money you gave him, I wouldn't. I wouldn't complain. They did learn their own. Look, I think the only two things you said about me is uh, I, I'm, a, I'm a creep and I lie, which both are true. So I can't. Who said he hated me? Yeah, no. Like as long as Chicky doesn't think I'm a creep, I think I'm doing good. Right. So well, why do you and your wife hate me bedtime time? So, uh, we don't why do you, you and your wife hate me? I don't like the behavior. Else. Oh, this is me in real life, too. I don't change. No, I, I, what I mean is any in any way, shape, or form. On, on YouTube, off YouTube, don't watch it. Do, do, you know, do you know when I first met Connie, I was trying to help him out. I gave him money also. Bought him cigarettes. You know, I stayed up late with him, trying to get him to calm down. And then he turns around and tells me I raped my daughter. No, I didn't know that. Yeah. Uh, real, real quick citation. Uh, it turns out that Kate was actually the one that wrote the Turtle Boy article. That's when she was still working with him. That's why it's all facts and not conjecture. So, there you go. I, I think you know who Kate from Masshole is. No, I didn't. I we didn't. know of her, but guys, just keep in mind, we came She does to, really good work. Yeah, we came into a community cold, and we had to learn what we had to learn. Yeah, you did. Can, can I have Grand Jaw with Drama Dome brand now? Uh, Can I brand y'all with the Drama Dome brand? No, I ain't branded with shit. I don't. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, do you not do you not have tattoos? Is that not a form of branding? I don't understand. Uh, you know, he I also wished. I mean, I guess if you want to. He also yeah. wished that a man that was deployed would return home. Yes, and he also said that he uh, said that Hank's wife killed herself to get away from him. Also, a now, now Hank, yeah, Hank is not only a veteran, but him and his wife were officers for years, decades. He's served our country. He's an American hero. I, I understand you don't like the behavior that I portray because sometimes it's pretty harsh. But he deserves everything he gets. Yeah, but no, he really said. no, he, he, he definitely does. deserves everything he gets because it, it, he, he consciously makes a. Uh, an effort to yeah. be the, the, to be the person that he uh, well the, that people I'm, well not portray he is the person that people say he is and, and he used this mental illness as a crutch look he ain't no more he mentally he, that is, up, he, he is, is no mentally Ill, Ill. he's life. no more mentally ill than I am mentally ill I mean for God's sake he's putting a dead autistic woman's picture up saying his dick gets hard to it. Is this the woman that was in the uh, in the Eagles in the, in the Eagles? Yeah, uh, Green Bay Packers. Yes, yeah. it, 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 Packers. Really, I'm sorry, not Eagles. Packers. It, it's Her. really disturbing and disheartening to even just see her picture being used as a sick bastardization of points. Just That's to get her. He's so full of hate that the hate fuels him. And he has to use it to trigger people because you know, I, that's I what he's good for I, is hate. I understand that a lot of us have used his grandmother's uh, obituary photo. And we've done that because of the shit he's doing now. Like He he, he started out using Brent's dead, uh, I think, sister or sister-in-law. It's like, yeah, it's photo. And, 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 and so that's what got the whole, the whole dead family's photos being used. Is when he started, one, started the one doing it, right? We didn't just come out and start doing it. No, no, no. He gets, what he, he, he gets back what he gives out. It's just we're better at it. So he started. He started out on Facebook, right? Yes. Yes, that is correct, sir. I don't have. I don't have Facebook, so I don't. I don't know the whole history. I just know what I've heard Brent say. That he started out on Facebook, and then I guess three years ago or so, something like that. He. I don't know. Brett was involved with Turtle Boy. I guess was his co-host. He had. He had doxed Brett's. Uh, I think it was stepsister. Who had recently died from cancer? Okay. Um, okay. Cut the eyes out and put her up on his show to mock on, him. Was this on Facebook or YouTube? Was this no, this was on YouTube. Yeah, this was on YouTube. YouTube. Yeah. yeah, I've got a um, video where he was using that photo on on a panel. Yeah, I mean, the, like with the Brett thing, he will tell you all day long that Brett started it. No, he did not. Listen, I've seen Brett getting some frivolous fucking arguments. I love the guy like Brett. I'd give him a kidney if I could. However, like this shit with Lycan Legion right now, 
He's mad at him because he disturbed his lunch. He's trying to listen to Bond movies. That's ridiculous. That's, that's ridiculous. Come on. We can all agree that's a ridiculous reason to go after something. However, I don't know that use, it's that ridiculous, but okay. <laughs> if, if you use an image of my deceased family member and then make fun of her for having colon cancer. Uh, you, you see, in, in one hack of, honestly, bedtime class, you would have loved one hack of. She was a sweetheart. She loved everybody. She did. She, would. she We could have she a shitty was, day, and she would put a smile on your face. Absolutely. She was always laughing. She was always having a good time. Honestly, I fucking hate Polly, but the interactions that one hack of and Polly had, they, they made me smile. I thought it, it was hilarious. They were great together. They were wonderful together. This is the only time you're gonna catch me complimenting that Paul again. That's it. I can show you my Discord server, and I still have, where she come to me and begged me to get rid of him because he was harassing and stalking her around. Because he still has DMs of that. Yeah. Speaking of Discord, can you guys please confirm for everybody that you've never seen us? No, anymore? you've never you've never been in my Discord. Not once, not ever. You don't even. Uh, know yes, yes, called. they're both you... in Discord. They both work for me. I control everybody. Yes. Andrew's just being a dick. <laughs> no, he always uses that. Connie, Connie is banned from my Discord for obvious reasons. So to him, it's some sort of mythical crystal kingdom that anyone he doesn't <laughs> like suddenly joins. And honestly, I'm, I'm going to be deadly honest with you. I'm not even in my Discord half the time. I'm in a different one. I just okay. desire to be in there, but just Tonic, I found you through um, Andrew as well, and 
the internet. You don't. Right. I mean, yeah, 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 you, you don't have to take responsibility. That's what you know. This guy Tarquin said that to me. It really hit me hard. I go Tarquin, why are all these people doing this? It's some sort of hole, you know, whatever. And he goes straight up because we're on the internet and nobody has to face actions for their consequences. That is why people act. If you were at work, would you work with a guy like Connie with an attitude like that? I work with a couple. Well, I, 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 yeah, and I do too, and I don't have that choice. <laughs> I can't fire him, so, I mean, I just have to conduct if myself. He, if, he, if he had the choice, though, you would, and it's not who you Well, no, if I had the choice, of course I would, but in every place I've ever worked, I would not have to do I don't know, I've, I've never worked in a place with a character like that, and even when I did, So much so that other employees would bully the shit out of them, you know, uh, or attempt to bully the shit out of them, uh, just because they didn't like them. I mean, short of just taking them out in the parking lot and whooping their ass, you know, uh, nobody wants to catch a charge, you know. Um, but I mean, that's just that's just life. I mean, my boss is kind of that way, and he's my boss, so there's nothing I can do. Fucking acts a certain way. He, he uh, conducts his finances a certain way. He doesn't. He doesn't. No, man, no, 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 I know that is. I had a, I had a boss just recently. Uh, who, God, he was the worst. Um, you ever heard of a convenience judge? A what? Yes. Check this out. Okay. All right. I was I was working at this fucking place, uh, just slinging food, right? Uh, and. This guy, uh, the owner, uh, one day put up a 4% convenience charge. Now, what that meant is that if you were paying a card, right, or debit card, credit card, what have you, they were going to add 4% to your bill just for doing that. And the boss told me, he goes, oh, just tell them that the credit card companies made us start doing that. Right, if anybody asks. And there was a lot of people who asked, believe you me. Okay. So I had a guy come in, he was getting sandwich and I go that'll be a four percent upcharge are you okay with that he goes why and I go oh the credit card company started making us do that he goes no they did but what what are you talking about yes they did it's what my boss said he goes I work I work for Chase I work, I work for a credit card company they don't do that that's your boss ripping people off yeah, yeah. like, like he, he's just a he's a real piece of shit you know but that's sure nice. That's something my boss would totally fucking do, man. That, that yeah. is something he would absolutely fucking do. But, yeah, I can I, I see where you're coming from. There is plenty of people like Connie in, in the workplace. Yeah, I, I, I guess I, you know, without even realizing it, I have ran into a few myself. Fortunately, the place I'm at now has got some. Um, but, man, yeah, yeah, there's... I guess the difference is Connie just... No job and no willingness to give one. And that, to me, absolutely drives me insane. Uh, I, I don't know, man. I, I, I said in his chat a few months ago, somebody was going at him about getting a job, and I said, if he, if he wants a job, he'll go get one. He got all fucking offended and butthurt about it. And that's kind of when, in my opinion, the, 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 the problem started. Um, Star, you know, was trying to, she's got a lot of experience with like psychology and that kind of shit. She was really trying to talk him up and be positive with him and all of that kind of stuff. Um, but, you know, I mean, it ended exactly how you guys said it. Um, and like I said, or was trying to say earlier, you know, he called and he's right her over the phone. I said, give me the goddamn phone. And, you know, I just started going at him, you know, and telling him, dude, you're not going to fucking abuse her like that. Fuck you, you know. Yeah. 
you're you're being a fucking piece of shit. You know you're fucking being a piece of shit. You, you know that this goddamn mental health excuse is just that a fucking excuse. Um, I don't know a whole lot of shit. I asked him. I said, "You want me to go live and let there, since you won't unmute uh, your fucking live stream, I'll go live and I'll let you let everybody hear what you're fucking actually saying." Um, now there there was one more thing before I get out. That I wanted to confirm. Okay, so like you had said, that comment that I had put up earlier in the video, um, which I'll, I'll go ahead and retract that. Let me go ahead and get rid of that. Um, right. Yeah, that wasn't me. No, you. no, it's fine. It's fine. If I'm wrong, I'm wrong. But I'm also going to sit here and tell you, hey, I fucked you up. My apologies. There you go. Bam. Bada boom. Bada bang. Gone. Okay. That being said, there is no recording of him asking. Okay, because I had like I had like five or six people jump at me, being like, "Did this? You know, they mm, <laughs> this is it wasn't good. What good? I Can really get rid of tech dimension." Yeah. Um, sorry, Tony. No, you're fine. Right, you're right. You're right. Fine. Right. Um, but I I just had to like if I'm going to keep pushing forward with any of this, and that's not true.
We didn't even know you were. Do you realize how much work we had to put in just finding your blueprint? We just don't believe it because we know you're living normal. Well, I mean, you know, it's... Well, no, 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 no. I'm not talking it's about It's disturbing. It's, 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 it's,